you guys? Welcome back to my channel. Today is a uh, day whatever. Um, it's probably one of the first ones of our 30 days of Halloween. Just not day one. So, I never use these. And I should because I have an entire one, two, three, four, five, seven, seven. And they're envelopes like this but I think this one has more than just anyway you know nail protectors um we're just gonna do a really quick little um okay so we're gonna go for this there we go so I will take a sponge a sponge I said that really loud I'm sorry to hurt your ears it's early come on coffee gel 310 in the morning 310 Anyway, so I don't want a straight ombre, like, going across, you know, like you would. This is just the corner of an old sponge. And I did kind of mush it with a little bit of what I sprayed it and then squished it out. So it's it's a little damp, but it's not drippy. Um, I, so, again, I don't want just straight edges so what I'm going to do is put the black over the like probably up here and then the blue here and kind of just um or was that blue or gray that I used blue blue by you this one straight up black obviously and then the uh gray that I'm using is asteroid um smudge free top coat and uh, then this one's just sitting here, uh, oily, polished, all-in-one top coat. This is Maniology M516. This is from this year's uh, Box of Night. Check it out. Oh, we're, we're doing coffins. This one is going to be so cool. I'm not sure what day, but later, because I don't want this and this back-to-back. I guess it really doesn't freaking matter. Anyway, we're doing this. We're going to reverse stamp this castle on when, you know, the entrance into the the graveyard. And then we're just random use the graveyard, these two. Okay? Okay. That's what we're doing. Double stamp over just this blue that I have. Um, I, wear, I always wear blue on my nails. So... <clears throat> well, left hand, sorry. And someday we might just go to one blue nail, but you know, for for now, it's working. Look, this is how much I don't use them. I was going to do it this way. What a dork. So, Colorado is so dry. People think I, I'm crazy when I tell you. It is a desert state. It is very dry here, so, and winter is coming. If you know, you know. I'm going to put these on. Um, these three nails. I'm going to put the the entrance on this nail. And it's already somewhat ombre. So, you know, got lucky. I'll be right back. Okay, so as you can see from the accentuation of the black tape. Accentuation. Is that a word? You know, uh, the growth of... I could have filled it in. But because I'm going to, um, I'll wear this Manny for a few days, wear this design, but this is a gel base and I am using air dry stamping polish. So when I choose and, um, air dry top coat, I can wipe this off, clean it off with alcohol, I mean with acetone, and then I will just have this plain blue background again so I can reuse and reuse so you know something to think about <clears throat> anyway that's what I do so I got these on here and I'm I was just gonna grab my little tweezer thing but why okay so I'm gonna grab the straight up black and the blue by you this blue is so old you guys where I can in this video, I'm going to fast forward and it may just happen at intervotes, introvert. It'll happen. It'll just happen. I'm not going to warn you. So 
if it happens, um, I'm just trying to get through explanation and get it done in front of you without making this video 25 minutes long. Nobody wants to do that. So that's what I'm doing. Anyway, so I'm going to put some black at the tip. Now, I don't need a whole lot of black, so I'm just going to kind of like that. Oh, that's not what I wanted. I want it on the other edge, this edge up here. It's not gonna matter. That is not gonna matter. I just want it up here. Okay, so, and then I'm gonna pop some blue in just, um, like that. Okay. Uh, I am gonna tap this off. Um, here, I'm going to tap it so you can see, but I don't want it in my, I always do it and then put my arm in it, so. I'm just going to tap, tap. I don't want to saturate it with black. I might have to come back with some of the, the blue bayou, but I don't want it completely like. Cover it all in black. All right, we'll just get the black done and then come back. Okay, so background set. Perfect. Now, I hate wasting paper towel. <laughs> so we put that up there. It's dry now, so it won't stick to the underneath of my arm. All right, so let's put the blue by you away, and we're going to grab Asteroid. Now, um, some people might want to, at this point, um, smooth this out, smudge-free top coat this, but I'm going to use it to my advantage because it's still kind of sticky, and I don't have a whole lot, I don't have any sticky, this is, I didn't even buff the top coat of this, it's a gel top coat, so I didn't even buff it, so it's kind of nothing sticky, so this will help this stuff stick to that. All right, so Box of Night Stamper, I love this thing. I just took a brush and some gel paints and filled it in. It's cute. Anywho, um, yeah, because I don't have enough things to paint. So I'm going to use gray in the background. We could just start right here at this tree. That tree's kind of boring. There's like nothing next to it. Let's see. Now, <clears throat> the very negative space, so scrape with the negative, not against it, and you'll get a better pickup. All right, so I'm just gonna take some of this off. I mean, I appreciate the fact that everything is grounded. Um. We could put this one right here. Don't stick. Okay, that one there. And then we could put... This one, and I'm going to pop, uh-oh. 
I'm going to kind of split it like that and then move this one over. I'm going to take this part out. Come on. Come off. And then move this over. We just have to remember what we do when we come back to double stamp it. Um, that, that gravestone might cover the other one, and I'm okay with that. It's just I need to line them up. Okay. Whew. Just like, uh-oh. Uh-oh, it didn't stick. Well, poo-poo. The cross did. Okay, so, and, and you know, it's not perfect, and that's okay, because it's just really the shadow. We're just, we're just putting in the shadow to the tree right now, or in the gravestones, but, <clears throat> oh, poo, I just sprayed acetone all over the window blind. Hi, those spots are clean. Straight of black. <clears throat> trying to get this whole scene again so see I dug out let me just try and refill it <clears throat> all right so I'm gonna leave the bottom a little thicker so I'm not worried about its adjustment I mean, I'm just going to adjust it as I want. That's what I meant. All right. So we're going to put this one here. By this tree. We're going to come around here. And come off of there. Oh, it's perfect. All right. So this one... We're going to start and I'm going to try and pull away because remember we kind of went over this edge with I'm going to cut it all the way back to there <clears throat> let me clean this up alright that works uh, where are we okay so now this time I'm going to go to the tree and try and line up at the bottom with the cross and the tree stump I think I got it for the, you guys can't see I'm sorry oh perfect oh 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 all right so I'm gonna do the same thing on this nail I don't know why I don't have cotton over here, but okay, we can do that. Uh, except this time I'm going to grab these. Just a different section of it. Maybe no trees because it's getting closer to the entrance. I don't know. <laughs> we can all work on it together. Um. All right, so I'm going to... Kind of somewhat center that just to give us something to focus on when we come back to double stamp that. Oop, get off my desk. All 
All right, so hopefully the birds will line up. I don't really like double stamping birds, flying birds. All right, so I'm gonna try and line these up. Oh, good job. For the most part. Oh, love it. Oh, my lordy. Love it. Okay, so now let's get to the castle. And it will dry really fast. That's why it wasn't really castle entrance. I don't know. Um, this tape is driving me bonkers. And I just have to say that this is so much easier than trying to clean straight up black off of your cuticles that are already sore and because you use acetone a lot. Um, are we done here? Yeah, yeah. Okay, so let me please exit my life. Thank you. Oh my gosh, you guys, those are so cute. All right, okay, stop. Um, we're going for... I kind of am liking this instead of that one. Let's just keep the cemetery sort of theme going here. Yeah, I think I'm going to use this. I, I really liked that one when I did it in a test but now that I'm looking at this, I like the gargoyles. <clears throat> Excuse me. I don't think I need, I, I don't need all of that. And the moon's kind of cool. All right, so again, I have this wonderful ombre already there. And I want the gargoyle. Is that what you call them? Yeah, gargoyle. Okay, perfect, perfect. What am I doing with this? Why, why? To make your life easier, Jill, not harder. All right. Now let's finish this with some black. That looks like 14 ounces too much. Oh, hey, stand back here up. All right, let me, did you see what I just did with straight up black, straight down my finger? That was so silly. Anywho, we're gonna, I didn't get all of the moon, but I think I'm okay with that. Yeah, the moon kind of turned out just a tiny little spot and it made it, it works. It works. Okay, so uh, I'll be right back. I'm going to clean smudge-free top coat. I'll be right for you guys. It'll be nothing. Hang on. I don't want to brag, but damn, these are cute. Well, cute in a cool way. Um, Yeah, I'm really liking... Oh my gosh, I am so liking this one. Anyway, what do you guys think? Let me know down in the comment section. I'll give you a still shot at the end of the video. I'm going to let this smudge free oh, finish drying. I don't know what happened there. Okay. I'm gonna let it finish drying and then I will top it with Orly. But this one is smudged, topped, and finished. Oh my gosh, you guys. So, I love it. I love it. I love it. Great addition to my Halloween plate uh, box and night. I just checked on Maniology's website. We'll actually get emails, so I went and checked the five plates and. The polishes that came in the bundle uh, are the box of night. Is that the right box? Come on, help me brain. <clears throat> Last year was the box of magic, or yeah, this year is the box of night. Yes. 
So <clears throat> the five plates and the three bottles that came in the box of night are available, uh, released on Manny Allergy's website. My Manny Allergy ambassador code never naked 10. Use that at checkout and you can save 10% at checkout on the bundle. And I don't know if they're selling them individually or not. I just saw them like in a picture as a bundle. Um, and my brain didn't say go look because I already had them. You know what I mean? Scroll, scroll. Anywho, um, <laughs> go check it out. And uh, yeah, use my code. Share it. Share this video. Subscribe if you haven't. Please join me on my journey at uh, 30 days of halloween -y. Super cute. I am loving this plate. Just the trees in general. You don't have, I mean, you could have this plate and use it in June f to have trees and change the colors. I mean, I'm, you know, you can use green and brown and, you know, spring colors. But they work great in the graveyard, too. I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. This plate will be back again. I will catch you guys in the next video. Uh, don't forget to smile the grumpy boy or boo.